All right, sorry about that. Got a phone call. Got a forklift going by, but we'll work with you. Uh, moving forward, you can see the table here. This will come down to this level so that this entire area uh, is a full sun pad. It's a pretty cool feature. And it is motorized, so the table will go up and down through this. And you also have a, another remote for your Fusion stereo right there. And more hookups for electric reels, whatever else. Um, as mentioned, the teak table, she needs a little love. That's something we can take care of though. Fairly easy job. Um, just a close up of the cushions. You can see they're not, they don't feel bad or anything. They just kind of, looks like the sun just got to them a little bit. A um, little bit of dust, a little bit of sun. Um, again, I had mentioned that we had three or four thunder, six thunderstorms probably in the past four days here. So she does have a little dust on her. I apologize for that. Uh, looking forward, this cushion is getting replaced as well. You can see the seams are just barely starting to split. And then this one, they're splitting a little more. But we're going to replace these three, I guess, two, whatever you want to call that. These three are going to get replaced. These two are going to get replaced. The one that goes here is getting replaced. And same with this one here. And then all these, all the combing pads that go around the entire boat, they're actually in pretty sharp shape. They're looking pretty good. Small little scuff here. It looks like maybe when he was fishing or something, a fish hit it. Nothing crazy though. Nice stainless steel handrail. Goes around the bow of the boat. And that's pretty much our boat. Good size windshield wiper. Uh, this is a nice feature when you're running. You can pop this open, get a little bit of airflow to the console. Of course, between that and the air conditioner that you have, pretty comfortable ride. Uh, let's hop up here. I'll give you a tour of what we have. Oh crap, we do have FLIR already. Didn't even notice that from down there. Bonus. <laughs> uh, so here's your open array radar from Ray Marine. Spotlight, you got the upgraded air horns, which is nice. Uh, your anchor light in the back. You have mounts for your outriggers there. And then there's your VHF antenna. Um, and then this hard top is sturdy enough for you to climb up here. You know, at the sandbars, you can jump off of there if you want to get uh, you know a little better sight of a ball of bait or something if you're looking for um, definitely kind of cool feature now let's check out our cabin Ugh, walking down there's your outriggers um, you have a table this actually comes up so you can have a table for entertaining or leave it as is for sleeping and a bed and all that fun stuff um, you have additional room for rod holders up in the front, courtesy lights throughout, nice window to look through. You can have it shaded or not. Uh, we got a good size TV here. Pull this out. Looks like another fridge right there. This, I believe, is the trash storage. Looks like we got a little butcher block here. More storage. Looks like that'll actually hold ice, maybe. Put your wine in there, whatever. Over here, sink. Pop this up. Let's see if I can't just move this over. There you go. This folds up out of the way. You can store it. There's your sink. More storage in here, it looks like. Not sure how to open that one. I'll mess with it in a minute. There's your remote. More storage. Remote for the TV. Popping open the head here. Oh, and look above me. I don't think I pointed this out to you. <laughs> Got a nice sunlight here, and those blinds will close up for privacy as well. Right here, you have a full head. There's your shower, which is nice. Drains, controls right there. You have plugs. Nice uh, porcelain toilet with a holding tank and an overboard flush. Always nice to have. There's your sink. Got some mirrors, little window, so it doesn't feel as cramped in here. Pretty nice setup. Uh, over here you can see we have even more storage. Then here's all your controls for your AC power, your generator, um, all that fun stuff here. There's the main unit for your fusion stereo, all your battery switches and controls, master ignition switch, um, everything right here ready to go. And we have simple um, 
instructions here too just a little reminder to run through and how to start how to hook everything up to shore power all that fun stuff launch port unit there and uh, that's pretty much it this uh, this first seat that you had mentioned this just looks like a little stain rather than a tear um, like you uh, like Michael had mentioned I think this one was sat on the most when they came down into the cabin um, but what we'll do is we'll we'll hit this with uh, with the cleaners and this stain, honestly, looking at it in person, it's really showing up on the camera. I don't know if you can see that, but in person, it's not as noticeable. Um, we'll run through that, see if it comes out, even replace it if need be. Um, who knows? We'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we come for it. Um, but again, this is Sean, Legendary Marine. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks, guys.